Hey everybody, what's going on? This is Robert McDougall with McDougall Insurance. And what we're gonna talk about today is ways we can save money on our homeowner's insurance. So stay tuned. This may seem really obvious, but one of the easiest ways to save money on your homeowner's insurance is to actually bundle your auto and your homeowners with the same company. Um, sometimes that's not the case because for whatever reason, it works better to have auto and home with different companies, but you always at least want to check because there's a good chance that you could save an exponential amount of money um, on just bundling your policy with the same company that you're currently with. There's going to be some companies out there that are going to want to give you a discount if you have your auto and your homeowner's insurance with them. And then you also have something like a motorcycle, a boat, or even life insurance. That can all be bundled into one package, saving you money. Okay, and the next way that we can save money on our homeowner's insurance, or really just save money in general, is to have a good credit score. And why that's important is because it's really going to go across the board when it comes to uh, anyone giving you a loan, insurance, um, any, anything like that is going to come back and uh, look at your credit score. So it's good to have a nice credit score. Um, I know we can't just automatically build one overnight, but taking the steps to get there will lower the premium on your insurance costs. When someone comes into my agency and they're concerned about their premium because it's gotten really high over the years, uh, the first thing that I want to look at is the deductible and kind of where that sits. A deductible works like this if you don't know. Um, the smaller your deductible, the less risk you're actually willing to take out of pocket, uh, the higher your premium is going to be. Now if you flip that over, the higher your deductible, the more risk you take out of your own pocket, but the lower your premium is going to be. So it really depends on just what kind of person uh, you are in regards to what you're comfortable with. But yeah, when someone comes in and they're paying a lot of money, first thing I ask is what's your deductible? Hey everyone, again, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. I hope I gave you some helpful tips. Uh, again, my name is Robert McDougall. I'm with McDougall Insurance here in Norman, and I hope you have a wonderful day.